great. Mic test. Can everyone hear me? A little soft, a little loud. Maybe I'm just speaking a little bit softly right now. <coughs> Alright, alright, cool. So, last we left off. The Scions are dead, missing or captured. We are left with Elphenol, the little dickweed. And we have found Master Sid Garland. We journeyed through quarters we got the airship and now we are about to hit uh, well we have to repair the ship first we have to find an elemental crystal so that we can get through Garuda's maelstrom typhoon hurricane howling wind thing so that we can kill the next primal so Let's get it on. The world is currently full. 23 players. I should keep track of how many players there are in queue each time I try to log in. See if it's growing or see if it's dropping. I'm guessing in five, four, three, two, I will have my fortune teller license revoked. I failed. Ah, oh, there we go. We're in. We're in. Rise and shine. All right. Actually, let's toss some. Maybe I can toss some things into the glamour dresser. Let's see. Just is there anything that I particularly like? Hmm. Nope. A pretty generic pair of pants. Four striker boots. Nah. Ah, collar for kitty. It's actually a pretty collar. That actually looks nice. Yeah, maybe I'll put that in. And I think that's it. Nothing else interests me. Alright. Speak with the foreign levy flyer at the airship landing. Alright. Heading up to the airship landing. Oh wait, no, no, no. Shh. I should drop by at... Okay, I'll hit the airship landing first. Wait, no. Ah, there we go. The lift. Airship landing. Okay. Foreign levy guy, where are you? Oh, nope. Is this? Is this it? Speak of the foreign levy flyer. Ah, 
Ah, it's the bar. It's the airport lounge. Haha. <laughs> I guess it's this guy, Free Brigade Flyer. Is this this guy? Oh, no, oh, I need to speak to the one at Limsa. Oh well. Alright. Shoulder tackle. I should unlock shoulder tackle. I should have had that a while ago. So, where's the closest crystal? Huh, what is this guy crafting? He's cooking! He's cooking! It's some Shogeki no Shoma shit right here. Oh, look at that pan! It's a fancy ass pan. He's cooking coffee biscuits. Huh. Well, s sorry, sorry. Must be distracting him. Alright. Let's go find our monk bro. Go Smith Skewed. What is this? Huh. Okay. It's Marvin the Martian. All right, Professor Eric. Hair breath from setting on his own. Hmm. Give me a second. I want to check something. Oh, no mind. Blah blah blah. Ever. He's talking shit about my monk bro again. So we're going to Eastern Lanosia, the Blood Shores. It's another battlefield there, and we're gonna scan that place. All right, all right. Cool, 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 cool. So I can go straight back to Limsa Lominsa. Lumsa upper deck. Ah, there's a bunch of waiters. Shall we dance? I suppose that's the dancer class. That starts the dancer class. All right, how do I get upstairs? Ah, shit! Wrong way. Oh, okay, this. I supposed to go all right I completely forgot it's the airship landing 
so I should have taken I should have taken the lift instead of climbing up the stairs. God damn it. Alright. Ah, there we go. Foreign levy flyer. Salute. Ooh. Where are we? Are we in Durota? Alright, that's our Maelstrom boys. So this is... The Twin Adders don't look so enthusiastic. The Immortal Flames place looks more like a childcare center. And there we go, Maelstrom boys, ready for a fight. So it's capture the flag. Ah, so this is PvP mode for capture the flag. Oh, so it's no killing. So it's a battleground, but nobody dies. Civilized violence. Okay. Interesting. I should have one stream dedicated just for PvP, because it sounds interesting. Alright. So the blood shores is right south of Costa de Sol. Okay. Oh man, look at the sun. Beautiful. Oh, do I have to swim? Oh no, it's just over here. Jellyfish! There are more. Alright. It's almost dead. Alright, got it. Are there more? Alright, no more. Oh, and he opened the chakra. Okay. Oh, is that it? Oh my god. So I did all that and... So I'm just going back now. Wow. Okay. Such an anticlimactic quest. Yes, I got an arrow meter for you. The device has suffered some damage. Unavoidable in this line of work. Alright.
Is that it? Wow, that's, that's really just it. Okay. Huh. That's it. Well, at least I learned shoulder tackle. Alright, we have one more quest. This one should be teaching me... Fist of Fire. Okay, increase my damage by 5%. Sounds good, sounds good. Good of me to come. Okay, yes. The data, the data I've procured is marvelous. Okay, okay. Hmm. No, your instructions have not led me to success. Your instructions have done nothing for me, dude. Not a career defining discovery. Eosia is home to numerous locations where the Aether is intensely in a chaotic state. Yet never played host to any war. The hypothesis was that the flux in the Aether is indicative of a past battle. Huh. What if the people of the past chose? Areas of rolling Aether to hold their battle. Interesting. He sent a simpleton monk. Don't talk to my bro like that. The border between Alamigo and Gridania was the stage of the Autumn War. Alright. So I have to travel to Snake's Mode, Snake's Mode and Southern Shroud and take the, the measurements. Okay, so I will talk to my monk bro at Little Alamigo and then we'll be taking measurements elsewhere. Okay. Alright, monk bro, where you at? Yo, monk bro. His work is not finished. The readings require more time, so I will go to Snake's mode in the South Shroud. Okay. Alright, before I leave this place, I'm in Southern Tanalan. Is there anything that I need to kill? Yes, Broken Water. Corpse Brigade Knuckle Dancer. Is that it? Yeah, that's it. So where is the South Shroud? Ah, this way. So Corpse Brigade. The Corpse Brigade should be around here. Oh, the music is so nice. Just listen to that. There we go. Down. How many more do I need to kill? Four more.
Primo. Two more. One more. I just beat your friend up in front of you and you're just pretending I'm not here. Hi. You're the smartest cops brigade man ever. Alright. So let's just head up to South Shroud. It's over here. So Silent Arbor is the closer. Alright. And it's raining again, as usual. It's always raining whenever I'm I'm around. All right. Oh, everyone is queuing up to head into that dungeon. Self. So. All right. Snake smoke. And these treants are nasty. Oh. I guess I have to kill you then. Oh jeez. Oh now they kill two of them. But this one's running away. And there's a bat attacking me as well. Oh man, he came back! So to use the arrow meter, I'm gonna get, I'm gonna bet, I'm gonna get attacked before. Oh, there we go. Oh, ew. Oh, they're level 40, holy shit. Oh shit, there's more. Got him. Is there more? Is there more? No more. Okay. An Aether of the Land. The Aether of the Land unlocks a chakra within me. More chakra! Chakra, chakra! Chakra, chakra! Oh, your friend just did a pivotal moment in the game. Oh, wait! Monk bro, what are you doing here? Were you watching the whole time, Monk bro? Monk bro... Why are you walking so slowly, ominous? Oh, 
you feel my chakra. Oh, pui out. He hoped to arrive before me, but he is late. The land's power has gone to me, and there's nothing left for him here. Huh. We monks travel to where Aether flows strong. The power of the land enters us. Our chakra expands. So we are just sucking Earth Chi everywhere we go. Okay. Hmm. He took no readings. He meant to his. So he's just using the professor to find it lands with etheric energy so that he can absorb the chi to unlock his chakra. Oh, he's being summoned a little alamigo. Okay. Oh, he's falsifying data. Huh. Sacrifice all for truth, yet be unable to truly know when one sees it. Ominous music is playing. Speak not of this to him, brother. You'll both see our aims. You know mine to be more worthy. What's going on, monk bro? Ominous music is playing. Why d are you going to betray me? Yeah, I mean, I go figure. I'm pretty sure every Alamegan is part of the damn Alamegan resistance right now. He yeah, escaped the occupation. He came here to fight. The people have forgotten. Alamigo is a distant memory. The resistance here is small. They ate where they can. The war demands great power and power lies in Chakra. Uh -huh. The chakra of many must be open. If this way is lost to me, he will have this power. To end oppression, end starvation, Alamigo must be made free. Bruh, you need... Okay... Bruh, need to chill, man. Ah, oh, come on. Alright. So, I'll head back to the Goldsmith skill. But Camp Drybone is nearby, so I might as well. Wait, which is close? Yeah, I'll go to Camp Drybone first. Alright. Level team EC upstairs or inside? Oh, let's just check. Inside. Alright. Lambertine. What up? Professor Lambertine. Yes, yes. He's research on corrupt crystals. Yes, your old friend Marquis needs it. Oh, a new turban. Oh, it covers my eyes. Oh well. An upgrade is an upgrade. Now I look like generic. Now I look pretty generic. Oh, can I lift the visor? Is that is that a visor? Wait, give me check. Give me a sec. Uh, wait a sec. Uh, 
social emo special visor. No, it doesn't count as a visor. God damn it. Oh well. In order to not cover my character's face, height hits it. Alright, there we go. Alright. Where to find fellow intellectuals? Well, not really, but uh, thanks. The hermit whom the church has given sanctuary. Yep, um, he's a master engineer, apparently. Yes, we're gonna harvest a corrupt crystal and use it to... Oh, Jesus Christ, what was that? Oh, it's a... Uh, someone else. Alright. Store the crystals which I seek in the watered pot to protect me from the dangerous effects. I will be bombarded with its energy until I put it in the vessel. Alright. Thank you very much. So where do I get the crystal? Deliver it to Hashako. Hashako is... Alright. You know what? Camp Tranquil, what? Wait, no, where is this place? It's Highbridge. Oh! There's no Choco Keep over there. Oh well. Oh man, when I was in the South Shroud, I should have hunted for these guys. I forgot, I completely forgot. Oh man. Oh well, I'll do that next time. I'm sure I'll end up in the South Shroud again soon. Ah, there he is. Hello, good sir. He's not contemplating suicide. He has chosen this platform to perform scientific measurements. Alright, okay, I believe you. Alright. I, Hahashako, creators of Professor Lambertain's pupils, shall see that you successfully quarry your quarry. Alright, corrupted crystals from the burning wall. Alright. I need to descend to the deepest depths, amidst the flowing waters and murder murderous mirror nights. Take the... Take, take the... Highly advanced researcher's tool. Separate small fragments from the big ones. Put it in the watered pot and bring it back here. Okay. The path leads from Burgundy Falls to the Burning Wall. Okay. The Burning Wall. So I suppose this crystal formations up there is the burning wall. Okay, I've been seeing these formations from afar for quite a while. Been wondering what they are. I suppose this is the Burgundy Falls. So this is the path that I'm meant to take. Hi. 
Okay, it's a Maoja that is not violent. <laughs> it's just random people hiding in his tunnels. What is this Mirror Knight? What a day! So they're bird people? Yeah, the bird people. Huh. Spooky looking guys. Alright, just gonna run past you if I can help it. Oh Jesus Christ. What is that? Oh god. Uh, run past it, run past it. Uh, okay. I think I have to go further down. Am I going the right way? Oh, this place is a maze. Uh. Nope, this is the dead end. Can't even jump down. Alright. So I suppose it's down this way. Straight here. Is this it? Nope. Down this. Okay. All right. Got it! Clean! Oh, so this guy is the Lancer. Huh. Alright, the crop the cluster is over here. So, do I... Okay, I'll hammer this thing. Alright. And then put it in the watered pot. And then head back to Hashashako. Yeah, I guess teleport to Camp Drybone. It's just easier to travel from here. You know, the burning wall doesn't look so burning in the day, but at night, it really looks really shiny. Hmm. Alright, haha Shako. Yes, I got a crystal. It's right over here. Alright, so now I must hit back. Ah, I'm lazy. 
Head back, presented to Lambertine. All right. Yes, your keen scholar senses detected it right. A corrupt crystal overflowing with wind expected aether. Oh, this crystal is wind expected, so it will strengthen Garuda's barrier. Oh, well shit. Okay, so we got the wrong crystal. Okay, any glove upgrades? Ooh, glove upgrades. Yes, yes, yes. I hope it doesn't look awful. Ah, uh, looks fine. No difference. No pants upgrades. It's fine. Alright, so... Sienna, his student in La Nausea. Eastern La Nausea was... She went, wandered too close to an Imperium Castrum. Huh. Western Latonsia. Pharaoh Cyrus in the Isles of Umbra. Dalamun's Terran Talents, that's there. Hmm. Oh, she's in Aeoport. Okay, that makes things easy. Oh, dude. Blur. Bruh. 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 Alright, if you want to kiss the quest giver, that's um that's your prerogative. Not gonna drop. Oh wow, it's raining so heavily in dry bones again. This place lies. They named this place wrong. This is not dry bones. This is wet bone. Wow, look at the storm. Holy shit. All right, to airport. Aeroport, here we go. I didn't even know this place is, uh... Alright. Nope. So I guess it's upstairs. Wow, look at this person. What is he? He's a red mage. Wow. It looks like some kind of superhero. Huh. Ah, Sienna, here you are. Bruh. Your master sent me here. Oh, so distrustful. Greatest of the professor's pupils. That's what the other guy said. Pharaoh Cyrus is replete with corrupted crystals of exceptional strength. She has yet to test her hypothesis. Okay. The Isles of Umbra is prohibited at the moment. Oh. Hmm. Alright, so I'll talk to the Yellow Jackets for you. Alright. 
Alright. Nothing there but death. Okay. There's not a lot of detail to go work on, but okay, okay. Oh, this fellow's upstairs. So that's a uh, augmented ironworks. Okay, so that's what that that gear set is called. Looks pretty badass. Wait, where is this person? So many invisible walls. Ah, there who this person is. Oh, so this is the prison, the stockades. <laughs> ha ha. House of Umbra. Well, I need to get the crystal there. Become naught but a graveyard of ships unable to navigate the shore. A purgatory for soul was dragged down to the depths with them. Oh, uh, that. The Isle of Umbra sounds like a bad place. I'll get it once I finish ARR 2.0. Okay. An armor outfitter. Is there anything good? Nope, nothing good. Ah, over here. Hey pretty lady, what's up? Oh, I clicked too fast. Well, I'm so I suppose she's gonna say the place is haunted as heck. Infested with the undead. Yes, yes. Uh, this talk, talk of spirit is not more than local folklore. Well, there's always a grain of truth in any folklore. The abandonment of Ferris Cyrus. She paid a visit to the local pub. Mm -hmm. So she likes to drink, she's an alcoholic. There's a man by the name of Skifrin. He returned from the Isles of Umbra. Okay, so I'll talk to this guy. Alright. So where is this guy? Skifrin is... Probably in jail. Hmm. Oh, you weren't here the last time I was here. She calls to me, sings to me. Tell Mimi Doa I'm sorry. Give him this, he was right. Ah. Looks like he's been bewitched. A siren or something. I suppose it's a siren. Hmm. Ugh. Yep, he's not very helpful. Oh, she knows who Mimidoa is. The bastard who grabbed her ass. Oh, heh <laughs> Alright. Do you need me to beat him up for you? I'll do that. Uh, okay. 
Hey you there, criminal scum. Don't grope her ass. Bad form. Bad form. Yep, your friend's key friend passed the feather to me. You're supposed to help patch up Ferris... Ferris Cyrus. Half of them walked off, half of them ran off, half of them vanished. Alright, so this guy has a... Has authority to go there to repair Pharaoh Cyrus. I assume that's a fortress of some sort. Yep, he gave me permission for passage. So let's go. Oh, so you're not following? Alright, it's fine. Hey, if I leave her behind to be a devoured by some abomination, you'll come back to haunt me. Sure, I wouldn't mind that. Haunt me if you dare. I'll kung fu your ghost. With some well placed feng shui, I can probably ex exorcise her or something. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Alright, I of Umbra. Oh, some equipment on the floor here. Yeah, it's not that bad. Speak to the man guarding the gate. I'm sure he'll let you in. Now, if you excuse me, she's going to hide. Alright. Speak to the man guarding the gate. Ah, this guy. David. Uh, I need to get some crystals. I return empty handed. Why, what's wrong? There are no crystals? Only authorized personnel may proceed past this point. Look up and see for yourself. When a massive when a mass of crystals struck the lighthouse, caused damage to the Okay. So so Pharaoh Cyrus is a lighthouse. Hmm. Unravel this mystery and he'll get me the crystal. Okay, sure. A party of three adventurers came ashore, looking to scavenge the trinkets at the ship's graveyard. Alright. So this is Pharaoh Cyrus. It's a pr this place is huge. This is a huge place for... This is not just a lighthouse, this is a fucking castle. Holy shit. It's huge. Oh damn. It might actually be bigger than Limsa Lominsa. What the heck? Alright, Louise, what's up? The voice, a single fleeting verse. Stay clear of the southern shore. Okay. Yo, chill, man. Dead people shambling about. Alright, so there's zombies. Alright, what about you, big guy?
So there was a nice voice, but queer dead things. Okay. There's some phasmophobia shit on this island. But if they have returned, okay, who are they? Receive word that Master Mimi Doa will arriving every moment soon. All right, let's go talk to Mimi Doa. All right, lighthouse dude, what's up? Some honey-voiced harlot has been calling out to folks wander near the ship graveyard. He was a cannon boy sailing under old Mistbeard. So he was a pirate? Alright. Who wouldn't? Bloody wood what? 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 Who did what? What? Yep, I was right. The siren. Feathers lure sailors to a watery grave with sweet, sweet song. No drowning from the start. Even in death, a man stays bound to the beast, forced to do his bidding, her bidding, until his corpse can't do it anymore. Wow, so this, this siren continues to haunt you after you die. It's up to us to stop this hellborn hussy before she takes another soul. Alright, sure, let's do it. Let's beat her up. Let's beat her up. Oh no, why is the FC talking about chicken nuggets right now? The FC is talking about chicken nuggets. No. Oh, now, now I want some McSpicy. There's a fate here. Uh, the Mantis King. Right. Oh, jeez. Oh, it's a skeleton. Dead Man's Moan. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I, I heard about the. So apparent, apparently in the UK, they have uh. They just, they just got the chicken McSpicy. So like um, a lot of the British people are complaining that the chicken McSpicy is way too spicy. But the reviews from Singaporeans is that um. The chicken McSpicy there is not spicy at all compared to what we have here. So all we can say is, um, why so weak? Why so weak? Why you so weak? Hiya, so weak. All right. Time to beat up a siren. <laughs> oh. So it's just two of us waiting. Oh, poor, poor boy is falling asleep. The old man has. Oh wait, what? I don't... Hear what? Oh shit! Oh! This shit's pretty hot! Shove them plugs in your ears and get ready for a fight! 
as soon as she realizes you're deaf to her DDs, well, we can be deaf to her DDs, but we are not blind to her titties. She'll call her thralls and we'll be up in our neck green corpses before we know it. Alright, alright, we'll beat them all up now. Let's go. Ah, she's singing now. Alright, let's go. Alright, send me more, let's go. Six sound. Is there no one else? All right. So he sent four this time. Who's next? 10 down. Give me another 10. Come on, bring it on. Three more, okay. What is this sweet song? What is this sweet song? Oh wait, ouch, did I, did I take damage? Oh they're coming from behind now Charmed Captain is down. What's next? Bring it on. Any more? That was easy. Clap, 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 clap. Yeah, but we didn't beat the siren up. We only beat her zombies up. Should not be coming around here again. Are you sure? We gotta beat her up first, you know? You know, send her to the kitchen or something? Oh well. I'm sure the siren will be back. Alright buddy, I, I chased your siren away, 
How was I able to resist a song? I'm deaf, you see. I don't listen to anyone. Alright, so you got my Corrupted Crystal. Thank you! Alright, so head back to Sienna. Sienna went all the way back to Aeoport before I did. Alright, so she only came here, showed face, and ran off. Sure thing, sure thing. Yes, of course I'm alive. I do good work, and I got the crystal. Oh, so this is a fire crystal, so if it converts Garuda's wind into fire, you'll just burn the ship up. So we're hoping to find ice. Oh well, so we got the wrong crystal again. So we're going to Gridania. This is not another wild dodo chase, you sure about that? There's been two wild dodo chases right now. Hayden suggests the finding would be quite safe. It has undergone a unique process. Okay. Sure. So it's literally in Gridania city, okay. I guess I'll take the airship. Now you know what? So I'll head down to Limbs to, to Uda first. Once I reach Uda, I'll turn in my monk quest. Then I'll head up to um head up to Gridania. All right. All right. I'm now in Uda. All right. So just run up to the crystal. Goldsmith skill. Here we go. Eh, this guy. Sub professor. Monk bros acting a bit weird. But nothing to be worried about. Alright. Now I have Fist of Fire. So that will improve my DPS. Yes. So Fist of Fire. What is 4 Point Fury? 4 Point Fury is an AoE skill. Okay. A Dragon Kick looks fun. Alright, cool. Which reminds me, so... Fist of Fire, I should put it. Hmm. Put it here. It's like a dance.
<laughs> Alright. So now to Gridania. Now to Gridania. Crystals here. Airship landing. Yeah, the, this, this monk, this monk, me, I am planning something. I'm planning to become a samurai in six levels. You know, someone was thinking about the airships we have to travel like back and forth from city states. Are there no seats? Do we stand the entire way? That seems rather uncomfortable, don't you think? Like, what's wrong with chairs? What about some safety belts? Don't ask. <laughs> safety belts are for the weak. Oh wait, I know why there are no safety belts. You don't take 4 damage. when uh, You don't die from 4 damage. Alright, where's this? This is... At Miyaketo. Miyaketo Amphitheater. Yeah, yeah. You, you only die if someone aggroes. So, like, um, if you're married, you have permanent wife aggro, or you have permanent husband aggro, you're sure to die. Ah, a scholarly, nice looking chap. The standing courses. Okay, where is that? In the twelve woods. Familiar with the Spriggans, yeah, I'm familiar with Spriggans. One such creature has an infamously insatiable appetite. Sigurd handedly devoured every corrupted crystal in twelve woods. Holy shit, okay. So it takes an eternity to digest. So I'm going to gut this guy and take the crystal out of him. Holy shit, okay. And you named him. You named the thing I'm going to gut. Bruh. So we need a Leo. Alright. When I, when I met this guy, I thought he was a nice scholarly man. He has his shoes. Okay, where is this... Where do I need to go? Central Shroud. So I will go down the White Wolf Gate. Is this the White Wolf Gate? Yeah, the White Wolf Gate. So White Wolf Gate should be close to... I believe... Oh no, I can just teleport right out. Married couple in Eorzea gets a ring where they can teleport to their spouses, yes. And once they do... Oh man, cheating would be really hard in Eorzea. <laughs> can you imagine you're in bed with someone who's not your significant other and suddenly your significant other just... Push! And she just teleports right next in. That's gonna be problem. Tancred does it all the time. So Tancred sleeps with married women. 
Or is Tancred married? I, I don't believe Tancred is married. I refuse to believe that man can be married. That man is too disgusting. The Tancred is probably too lazy to to be a good husband. Alright, Crystal Bearer. Oh, you're a big boy. Romping? No romping. No romping allowed. You did. Alright, so I now have the crystal. Uh, uh, God damn it. in this corner over here and teleport out. Alright. He sleeps with people for information. What a gigolo. Alright. Someone's playing music. Where is it? Uh, oh. Finish this quest up, get our crystal so we can kill Garuda. What's the smell? I just gutted this guy. What do you think I smell like? We owe our furry friend a debt of gratitude. He's not our friend. This thick coating of digestive juices is protecting us from the harmful effects of the crystal just as... Oh my god, that's gross, dude! Overflowing with earth? I was looking for ice! Oh, okay, you're, you're jesting. I was just about to punch you right into the water. Just kidding, I'm gonna push you anyway. I just, no. <laughs> Alright, so we got a crystal for Marquis, yep, yep. Oh no, don't worry, we are gonna use the crystal to save the world. Alright, so back to the airship landing. Yes. Sid, Elphinaut, how has the ship's upgrades and repair been doing? The ship looks exactly the same as I left it. Hey, Elphinaut. Why you, Terry? Excuse me, I'm the one doing the work. Shut up, little dweeb. I'm gonna punt you so far. I'm gonna punt you all the way back into the Empire. Alright, all the repairs and modifications are complete. Once we bring the crystal, nothing shall stand between us and Garuda. 
Alright. Here we go. Good job, Sid. Ever reliable, Sid. Let's go. Let's do this, guys. You're gonna run some tests to be sure. Alright. Yes. The Enterprise is really more than a common airship, but mark my words, soon it will become something greater. Something extraordinary. Okay. Shoes. Don't need it. I am now level 45. Nice, five more levels and then I can Samurai. Oh, and I'll get an upgrade. Once I defeat this, I'll get a hat. Ah, that's a nice hat. It's a feathered cap. Ah. Not too bad, not too bad. We'll leave when ready. Tess can only tell so much. Until we approach the Howling Eye, until we attempt to breach the barrier, we cannot be sure that it will work. Is a chance that the crystal might trigger what? No, no, dude, I need to know what. What might the crystal trigger? Dude! You can't just say, you know, it might, but never mind, never mind. Let's not worry about that. You can't do that, Sid. She's ready. Good. Let's go, buddy. Ah, she stirs. Don't hold his hand, he's about to fly the ship. What the fuck? with the harpy queen garuda by that you mean Engage. warp speed make it so key earl grey hot Am I just gonna stand there and smile at Sid the entire way? Damn it. What? Uh, I, I once flew in this airship, and I was not alone. Yeah, you probably had a crew. Adventurers on board. Adventurers like you. Ah. Let me guess, the warriors of- No, don't, no, Captain, don't fall- Don't faint- Wait, am I fainting or is he fainting? Just how long have I worn these damn goggles? I don't know. Since you- Since you became a Digimon Adventures protagonist? Oh, young Sid, oh, a wee yes. lad. I fancied myself a trendsetter in my younger days. He had the same hairstyle the entire life. The young prodigy, admired by all, exactly like his father. Born and raised in Garlemald. Oh, that's cute. It 
It was only natural that the precocious young student should become an engineer. Father, when did we stop seeing eye to eye? When did Meteor become your everything and your loved ones cease to matter? Oh dear. Oh. Isn't that the bad guy? You abandoned us all, but he was there for me, father. There for me when you were not. Though he proved no better in the end. Oh, okay. Gaius was just another man with an all-consuming obsession. Uh-huh. And so I ran, left the Empire behind, and came to Eorzea, where I built the ironworks. Oh, two friends. What is that? That's me. What? Ah, yes, it was then that I first donned these goggles. What? Eorzea opened my eyes. It was home to so many manner of people, each with their own hopes and dreams. People worth saving, and so I fought beside them. Huh. I wanted to prove that my knowledge could serve a nobler purpose. I wanted to prove that there was another way. So, a vision of me gave him the goggles? So, Tian Yi. Tian Yi. It all began that day when I found my new home. Huh. I had forgotten how wonderful it was. The wind in your hair, the endless sky. That light. It was you, wasn't it? Maybe. It's surprising how few people know this, but all pure blood guardians have a third eye. Perhaps mine helped me recognize you, or perhaps it was just a lucky guess. Who knows? Heaven's will cannot be revealed. The Enterprise was made for this. To carry Eorzea's protectors into battle. I am proud to be able to call her my own. Sid? What exactly do you remember? Alphinord, my boy. Sorry to have been such a burden. I remember everything. My name, my people, and my purpose. Everything. Come, it would be rude to keep Garuda waiting. Ah, he's so optimistic now. Okay. Here we go. Alright, so we just made it through. Did we use the crystal? I guess we made it through. Oh, wow. Hey, Sid. 
Oh uh, no, no. We're gonna do this. Alright. So Sarah Friendless Invite. Here we go. Alright. I think we can begin. Howling Eye. Oh, that's fast. Mm -hmm. The fourth DP, the second DPS is not ready yet. Could always eat. Oh, wait. Yes, thank you. Thank you for the instant kill. Look at everyone running in. Hey, Ash! Oh, it's Garuda time. Our insolence will not go unpunished. Oh! Hello, nurse! <laughs> Show friend. Yes, she is huge. Mm, where it counts. Aha! Uh -huh. Alright, let me guess. You two are going to run away and... Oh, okay. The Ixo are here. Huh. Oh, wow. Amarja and Kobo. Oh shit, they're sacrificing other beastmen? Holy shit, okay, the Ixo are pretty badass. P pretty effed up. Yes, you are the win. Okay, that's pretty brutal. Man, the Ixo are... The Ixo, are, the Ixo are extra brutal compared to the other beastmen. Holy shit, alright. So you give me the boss, while you guys hold off the small fries. I don't even know if those two can fight. Okay, the music. Alright, it's time to break wind. <laughs> Alright, she's pretty hot. I'll give her that. She's pretty hot. She's the kind of character that makes it difficult to... Um... Alright. We have... Uh, we have three... Free sprouts, Mummy Sarah carry us. Disappeared. Where is she? Countless feathers rain from the sky. What does that mean? for the heal.
She teleported away. I'll just follow you. Oh. All the pillars are gone. She disappeared again. Oh, it's over? Yeah, I went with Monk. Punch Punch. Punch Punch. My Kung Fu. Hiya. But the entire plan is. Wait. Ooh. I like where the camera went. Oh, she's still alive. You have no hope here. Okay. You think we can defy a god? We killed two gods already. What's going on? Are their prayers healing her? Oh. Their gift sustains me, their power and. None shall. Okay. So let's kill the worshippers to kill their god. Okay. Oh man, you guys got clap. All right, let's go for round two, mommy. Let's do this. Wall of stone will not shield them from the tempest. All right. Sure, sure. Keep taunting. Keep taunting me. You trying to try to tamper me? That did not work. Oh, I wouldn't mind that, but you know, I'm sorry. You ain't the one doing the claiming. Oh, her aura has been dispelled. Yes. Fantastic camera work. Fantastic camera work. Ooh, crystal. More meth. The Chaos Emerald. No, now is not the time for a trance. She's not dead yet. Stop falling into these stupid trances in the middle of, like, worst possible time. Alright, I completed the collection. Okay, so what happens? Something must happen. Oh, we'll figure that out later. Wake up, wake up. What have I done to you? Wouldn't you like to know? It's called Fist of Fury. Oh, the two useless guys came back, okay. Wait, what? Fist bump.
Why do you not tremble at my might? Why do you not beg for mercy? Why do you not die? Because I'm more horny than scared. We've done it. I've done it. Oh what? Oh, lady of oh that's the random. Oh mighty Garuda. Of all primals, the most terrible, I say again. Is that all? Is there no one else? Gaius. Ah, uh, Sid, my boy. You look well. For one who has forsaken kin and country. I wonder what else you will forsake before the day is done. What? What exactly did you hope to accomplish here this day? Defeat Garuda and earn the adoration of the masses. I... You... Well, I shall accomplish far more. Mm-hmm. Oh, dude. <laughs> Nice. Is that all? Is that all? Oh, she's sassy. Insolent mortal. I shall make you suffer. That foul stench. I see it now. She has touched you. No, pull out. No, who touched me? The one. <laughs> Oh, I love the camera angles. Mm-hmm. Yes. Hells, does she still mean to fight? Well, we didn't kill her, of course. Come on. I'm sorry, I killed him already. I'm sorry, I killed him as well. Okay. Wait, what? Wait. She just summoned Ifrit and Titan. What's going on? What? No. No, this is all wrong. Stop gawping, boy. We must run. Surrender yourselves unto me. I would feast upon your ether. None shall stand against the wind. I know they can be resummoned, but why did she summon them? Oh, is that Godzilla? Oh, this is gonna be a kaiju fight. Witness to the glory of the Empire. Yeah, but why did Garuda summon the other two? Oh, oh, she did not summon them. Oh shit, it is a kaiju fight. Oh, wow. Ifrit just got one shot, holy shit. Oh wow. Oh. Imperial Godzilla is cancelling the apocalypse. It is you who will suffer, Garuda. Oh my goodness. Ancient Alec had ways of dealing with your kind. Now, look on their ultimate weapon, Icon, and despair. Oh no! Oh no. No, no! Oh, poor Garuda. 
Oh shit! Holy shit! Magnificent. It exceeds all expectation. Oh my god! You just bit her head off. What the? With each primal it consumes, it grows more powerful. A marvel, is it not? Such is the fate of those who oppose the Empire. There will be no warriors of light to save you this time. If your leaders are as wise as they are reported, they will surrender. Your skills are impressive, but they will not be enough. Oh my god, he can fly! That doesn't seem anatomi anatomically possible. Well, have mercy. What chance have we against such an ungodly creation? And who was that armored devil? That was Gaius Van Balsar, Legatus of the 14th Imperial Legion and Supreme Commander of the Garlean Invasion Force in Eorzea. Of course, the Black Wolf. How could I not realize? Grandfather mentions him in his journal. When when the Godzilla thing flew away, it reminded me of um you know when Godzilla used his breath to launch himself off the ground in like the old rubber suit versions. <laughs> that's how like that's how anatomically weird that re that 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 is. Magitek, Magitek. Of course, it's always Magitek. Has to think the man would abandon his ambitions. But these developments are beyond my worst expectations. What have you been doing these past five years? How could something of this magnitude have escaped the Alliance's attention? Good question, Sid. Alphanaut, please answer. We heard no whispers, saw no signs. In the wake of the Calamity, the Empire seized land and built outposts. But that was the extent of their aggression. Incompetence. Incompetence. Damn it, Gaius. Where in the seven hells did you find that thing? It has been a day of unexpected developments. But the fact remains, Garuda is no longer a threat. While I take no comfort in the manner of her downfall, it does mean that we may safely put the matter of the primals to one side. For the time being, at least. Which just leaves the matter of Gaius's new toy. Mm-hmm. Indeed. That weapon poses the greatest threat to Eorzea. It must be destroyed. The ring must be destroyed. But first, we must needs find out all we can. Let yeah. us make for Vesper Bay. We shall rebuild the Scions. Oh, return to the waking all sands. Not yet lost, my friend. For we bear the light and shall surely lead our people from the darkness. Elfenort, you talk a lot, but you've done jack shit so far. Pray return to the Waking Sands. I wish Alphanaut would just shut up. He's done jack shit, man. Fat Popo. This guy's name is Fat Popo. This does not look like a Fat Popo. That is not a Fat Popo. No beast tribe would dare summon your god as long as the weapon exists. Alright, a new hat. New hat. He's ready to return to the waking sands. Alright. Wait a second. Wait, why are we in Uda? 
We left for battle. We left for battle from Gridania. The fight was in quarters. And then we, ca we came back. We retreated to Uda. Huh. Okay. Pray return to the Waking Sands. Or male auras chonking ties. Huh. Huh. Oh, blue quest. What do I get? What do I unlock? He knows a place where a skilled adventurer might hone his skills. Yeah, Vesper, Vesper Bay tickets. Aurum Vale. So I've heard. I have. I've heard they um. I've heard they streamline a lot of the quests. So like, I don't know. I I can't remember, and I don't know which ones I'm skipping. Uh, everyone's blocking the way. Uh, excuse. Nope. Alright, this place is empty as heck. It's so strange to come back here and it's all quiet. Is there anyone here? Oh man, this place is still wrecked up. Hey, no, one, no one has fixed the place. Sit in orphan order here. I see signs of recent habitation. Okay. Wait. What? Ida! Yay! Oh. No, we're fine. We're fine, Ida. She was still in the other's nest when the attack came. When she came back, what did she see? The church had... Oh, I've really moved the bodies away. Bloodstains were still here. If Ishtola... Okay, Ishtola was here as well. Ishtola helped her. Istola has gone to Uda to meet a man who might know what happened to the others. Papalimo is captured, Minfilio is captured. They possess something he desires, knowledge of another power. One Gaius has yet to harness. They want the Echo! Whatever that is. Yes. Immunity that grants the gift. Oh yeah, yep. His elegant weapon is only second to the power of the force. None of which explains how the Empire came to know the location of Waking Sands in the first place. Like I said, I blame Thancred. If anything goes wrong, it's all Thancred's fault. Empire shown his hand, now we must act. We built the silence to save Eorzea. 
Oh, wait, hang on. Who put Elphenord in charge? Excuse me. We discuss our next move upon Ishtola's return. Who put Elphenord in charge? Excuse me. Everyone's asleep. And let me guess, am I going to have another vision? A vision. Yeah, I knew it. Oh, Jesus. Yes, Galadriel. The great eye sees all. No, no, really, I, I, what is that? Bringer of light. Brave gatherer of the crystals, thy soul burneth bright. Okay. I am Hydaelyn, all made one. Hearken unto me now, for the darkness doth begin to spread. Wear thee the bearer of the crimson brand, for he is the avatar of shadow, whom death attendeth always. Dr. Balahabria? The crystals shall be thy salvation, thy blade and shield. Both. Why not my fist? Crystal fist. Thyself, for at the appointed hour, thou shalt stare into the heart of darkness. Okay. Go with caution, my child. But fear not, for I am ever with thee. I am one of the force, and the force is with me. Yay! Istola! We five should meet each other, defy simple explanation. It's as if the benevolent hand of Master Louis Zoua guides us still. I'm surprised the Empire didn't take the staff. Like, that would be a powerful symbol, would it not? She knows where Minfilia and the others are being held. Imperial stronghold in the heart of Mordona. Kestrum Sentry. I furrow my brows as if I know what's going on, but I don't. <laughs> okay, new equipment. Woolen tunic. Uh, doesn't look as fancy, but looks functional. But it doesn't go well with doesn't go well with the white boots. Okay, so can we dye it? Let's see, can I dye my boots? I don't I don't think I can dye my boots, right? This doesn't have the colour the colour the th the thing on the top right corner. So uh I guess I have to glamour it. Okay, cast glamour. Oh, let's see, let, let's try dyeing. No, I can't dye it. Oh, sad. So, let's just glamour the boots. Let's see which looks better. Oh, this looks fine. This looks fine. Let's, let's check the others. Oh, this looks a bit much. This looks way a bit much. Boring. Mm, doesn't match. Doesn't match. Mm. 
I think. Hmm. I think this is the best. Here we go. There we go. More fitting. Yeah. Looks much better. There we go. Yeah. Sit. Gaius may have a weapon from Ancient Alark, but extensive Magitech modifications. Okay. Imperial Castrum. That's a, I guess it's a fortress. Yeah, I like Ida. Let's do this. Let's rescue them. Let's go. Let's go. Let's do this. Oh, new gloves. I'm oh, looking forward to new gloves. Oh. Yeah, they look fine. They look good. Okay. Under normal circumstances, breaching the defense of an Imperial Castrum would be a highly dangerous proposition. The Castrum houses prisoners whom the Guardians deem valuable. Okay. If we are to free our friends, we need a effective strategy. Effective strategy means we need effective intelligence. Okay. Lord Portalane from House Dunadair. Stationed at the Observatorium in Cartus. Wait, so the guys at the Observatorium can see the guys? Sit. Okay. Alright. Yes, we punch them until we win. That's how it works. That's that that is the heart of kung fu. The heart of kung fu is we just punch and we punch faster and we punch harder until all our problems are solved. No, actually that's not the lesson of kung fu, but that's what I like to think. Oh, the Orum Veil is over here. Well, I'll not be doing the Orum Veil. I'll just turn in the quest. Since it's along the way, it's along the way to Moderna anyway. Mod Moderna, not Moderna. Do they give out vaccines in Moderna? That means there must be a town called Pfizer somewhere. Over here. Hi, Lord Portalane. Been a while. How have you been? Yes, yes. I should totally do. You want to do the Aurum Veil that bad? Okay. Which uh, data center are you on? Or are, are you on Kujata as well? This is Kujata server, by the way. What interests have you on? Yep, they hold our prisoners. We need info. Four prisoners led into the castrum. A Huron woman. That would be Minfilia. An Alison man. That would be Oriange. Two Lalafell. One male, one female. That would be Tataru. And uh, Papalimo. Well, there's a more recent incident. What incident? What's going on? An Imperial airship made emergency landing here in quarters a while ago. Two men, believed to be prisoners, a Rogadin and a Lalafell, were seen fleeing the craft. Oh, that's our friends. Uh, that is uh, Bix and Wedge. Alright, we, we need to save Bix and Wedge. Freeing those held in the castrum. Alright, so let's go save our engineer friends first. Oh, they will execute them if they catch. Oh, Sid seems optimistic. 
All right. Oh, cinematic. Oh, it's the bad guys, the Empire. Dum bum 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 bum. Saturday morning cartoon villains. Da 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 da. Huh. It looks like an Invangelion when it's in the scaffolding. I know preparations almost complete. Five long years of painstaking work. The power to purge this land of false gods. And drama mama, he has to take a knee like that. Vitalin departs for Kestrum or Cinders at midnight. Command the Western Front in Villebrand. Carry out his best of activity, alright. Is it proper to give the command of half our forces to... To who? Oh, to him? Okay. My quarters, one hour. Oh, are they gonna get funky? Are they gonna get funky? Oh yeah, someone's getting late. Can you imagine you just, like if you have if you know someone and they just like my bedroom half hour see you there <laughs> holy shit what the f all right upgraded gloves all right what's next all right purpose is to blah 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 oh yes all right so that's how you know. Reports of the emergency landing came by way of Zemo Dark Hole in the West. For expedite my mission, furnish me with a letter of introduction. Okay, so that means Biggs and Wedge are hiding in the Zemo Dark Hole. Over here. And then I have Orum Vale over here. And quarters is full of dungeons. This place is a mess. We can do Orum Hole for uh, Orum Vale first. Zemu Dark Hole, Subterranean, blah blah blah. None may enter. Alright, so I have to talk to. Who, who do I talk to? Who is this? Oh, wait, they're both at Orum Vale. Are they both Orum Vale? Oh, they're both at Orum Vale. Okay, so it's not Zimo Dark Hole. Or maybe I've really done Zimo Dark Hole, I can't remember. So, so Orum Vale it is. Uh, nah, nanny boo boo. All right, hello, Williamus. Ooh, a new ring. Oh. 
Oh wow, I have a level 5 ring and this is a level 47 ring. That's a big upgrade. Okay, good. Very good. Very good. Wait a second. Did I not get a ring? Oh no, it's for level 47 and I'm level 45. Oh, oh well. Pure Ash. Alright, do I get new pants? Yes, I get new pants. Alright. Prisoners aboard the airship, they will seize the opportunity to flee when the vessel was forced to land. The Guardians formed search parties and proceeded to scour the wilderness. Two sets of footprints, one big, one small, one rugged, and one dollar fell. So they are in here. Alright! Yes, I've been using a level 5 ring the whole time. Alright. So, Orum Vale, I'll invite Sarah. Um, message me in Game Ash so that we can join. I have no idea who you are in game. Oh, your game is updating. All right. <laughs> All right, I'll search the area. Oops. All right. So Orum Vale is not part of my quest right now, but I don't mind doing it. Got to find the footprints, got to find our two friends. Oh, I forgot food buff. To finish your backlog, what other games are you playing? Tracking the footprints down. Bigs and wedge. Where are you? Oh, whoa. Oh, hello. Why is your dragon's head in the snow? Like a, like an ostrich. <laughs> what is that? Are oh, you showing off your mounts now? <laughs> There's someone hiding under the bridge. Hello, witch. Wow, that's a lot of games. And they all start with at SRW and SW. <laughs> Oh, hey, buddy! Oh, don't eat me! Well, no, you don't even look like a good onion. You look like a rotten onion. Ah, oh, thank goodness you're here. It's been awful. Yeah. <laughs> Guardian snapping at the heels. Like, all right. So, where is Biggs? He went off in a different direction to lure the pursuers away. Yeah, we found Wedge. Biggs is still missing. Hit west. Both Yida and Yishtola are helping out. Alright. 
We'll keep an eye out for Bix. There's an Ishgardian fortification to the west, Monument Tower. Alright, let's head over there. Oh yeah, Bix and Wedge doesn't even know that Sid is alive. Alright, Sarah, do you have Ash on your friend list? Uh, I think Sarah plays a tank. Uh, I'll, I'll pass Sarah leader. Wait, how do we promote? Promote. Promote Sarah to party leader. Alright. Sarah's a tank. I'm a DPS. I don't know what you want to play. Sarah can play any role. So I guess it's up to you, whatever you want to do. Alright, uh... You able to add me, or do you want me to add you? Ash, what's your IGN so that we can add you? Koryu Otsuka, okay. Alright, so Aurum Vale, let's go. What? Am I too low level or something? I'm level 45. Yeah, why does the quest allow me? <laughs> alright, alright, I'll continue the main story quest. Frozen Corner of the Realm. Oh, poor, poor little guy. Alright. We'll get some rest while the rest, while the rest of the Scions get over here. Alright. Okay, which? What's your concern? Bix is all alone in the core of the Guardians on his heels, so he wants me to go out and search. Alright, sure, why not? Let's talk to Abby. Uh, Abby first? Oh, look at that aura supremacy. These two are like sharing aura supremacy right now. What the hell? <laughs> Fury's gaze. There's a cave there. By drawing the enemy to this tower, he may elect to pass us by. Alright, so he... Bix brought... Bix brought the bad guys... South. Into this little cave, okay. Destination. 
gonna get attacked by something. This is always how it works. Something's gonna spawn and attack me and jump me. Knew it. Of course. Of course. Are <laughs> you yanking me around? Time to get back to the tower, report to Wedge, his friend Biggs isn't here. So we need to find Big, someone in the tower. Ask. So he wants me to harass the people here. Harass them. Into telling me where Biggs is. Even though they probably would have told me long ago. Is there anyone here? Wait a second, it's, it's gonna ride my chocobo up to the top. Ah, uh, hello. He is not found in the vicinity of the dark hole. He is made for white brim. One must travel through the definite Denifen Pass. Okay. Tre we're already when climbing the stairs here. He broke his neck when he slipped and took a tumble. Okay. Well, I guess I'm just made different. <laughs> Oh wow! Oh, that's so cool! You have a carriage! Ah. That is so cute! Where to? Uh, just up north that, you see, if you open the map, you see like that little um... A uh, tunnel that goes to the north. Yeah, just at the entrance of that tunnel. Right click the map and enter. A control right click. There we go. Oh, that's cool. Oh my god, it flies! How does that chocobo- Okay, but it has um, it has balloons. Okay, so that makes some sense. Alright. Oh look, I, I think I, might, I need to drop party. Give me a sec. I'll be right back.
Oh no, they've captured Bix. They've yet to execute him. That's good. With the power of Kung Fu, we shall... F oh, he's a, he's a pugilist as well. We shall beat them all up with our fist. Of fury. Alright, three pugilists. Alright, let's charge! Charge! Oh, they're all quite beefy. Oh, the archers are quite squishy. Should have killed them first. Oh well. Alright, kill the archers first. That's the other business. Oh shit, I think Vix is dying. Oh shit. Gotta save him. Alright, that, that monk is dead. Marauders it left with this Oh wow there's more Left with this one. Ida took care of the other one. Good job, Ida. Alright, they all did. Three people with their fist versus mecha armor, swords, axes, and everything. Yes, all we need is our fist and burning passion. Oh, is he wounded? Oh, he's been too long in the cold. Alright, bring him home, bring him back to base. Monument Tower, yeah, let's go. Wedge is there as well. Oh yeah, happy reunions would be cute. Alright, back to the tower. Oh, you and your mecha suits. There's some zoning of the Ender stuff. How do I remove the flag that I laid down just now? Huh. Wait, the tower entrance is here. Alright, Wedge, brought your, brought your friend. I brought your friend. Oh, he's crying. Yes, the power of family. <laughs> Magitech may be strong, but what is Magitech compared to family? Oh. Yeah, 
The enemy struck with never a word. The the warning. The Imperial said, "I went at gunpoint." All right. How did the Guardians get there so fast? The immortal flames should have seen them coming. That is true. The Guardians came neither by land or air. They came by teleportation magic. The same kind used by Asians. Bounded and blindfolded and thrown into cargo. They were in Kestrom Sentry. Okay. Minfilia and the others were taken somewhere else. But they were bound for Gallimore. Okay. So they sabotaged the altitude control. So they crashed the ship. Alright, there's one thing about engineers. They can build stuff and they can sabotage stuff. The big guy stealthily sabotaged the machine while it's in flight. <laughs> Giant stealth. Alright. Answers can wait. We need to save Minfilia and the others. Alright. Carlon Ironworks is back in business. Awesome. Cool, 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 cool. Alright. I'm just a little bit from level 46. So let's convene at Revenant's Toll at Mordona. Good a place as any to prepare. The road leading east and then south will get me there. Alright. So we're going to Revenant's Toll. What the heck is that? <laughs> All right. To Revenant's Toll. Revenant's Toll. We are heading to Mordona. Oh, it's just south. Like, uh... Is the zone directly south of us? I suppose because you guys are so used to end the end game zones that you have kind of forgotten about like the ARR zones. All right, and I leveled up from experience, <laughs> from exploration experience. All right, Revenant's Toll. Alright, first things first. Touch the crystal. And Choco Keep. Choco Keep. Okay, got my Choco Keep. Alright, now talk to Slothborn.
Yes, our friends are held captive at Castrum Sentry. Alright, infiltration and stealth mission. He's gonna walk through the front door. He disguised himself as Imperial troops and... Alright, so we need uniforms and a suit of Magitech armor. Okay, we're gonna speak with Glaumant. He has a personal grudge against the Empire. Alright. Yeah, that's true, Yida does always... Yida does always, like, enthusiastic. So ganky. Bum bum ba da dum. Alright. Approach the sentry from the east. You see a swampland to the left got the tangle. Some drainage pipe. We can eavesdrop from there, okay. Good information. Good information. Look at all the mounts. A giant whale sheep. Okay, up this way. Look at all the crystals. Moderna is just f Moderna, Moderna, not Moderna. Moderna is just so full of crystals. Look at that. It's pretty. And more. Ah! Frogs. I hate it when they do that. So Mordorna is. Mordorna is north of Thanalan. Oh, it's in between all three of the city-states. Huh. So the Empire has like a fortress in the center of Eorzea. How did they even let them do that? That's some logistical feat right there. I'm supposed to be... Oh no, the pipe is at the other side. Oh, god damn it. So I gotta run around. Alright, I'll stick. Stick. Alright, the pipe is here, okay. Go, the pipe is here. Let me guess, something is gonna jump out of the pipe. Something's gonna jump out and attack me. Yeah, I knew it.
There we go. Alright, let's spy on them and listen through the drains. One of the captives, does she still refuse to speak? She may be a deaf mute for all the information we've gotten out of her, so she's not spoken. Ellison gets my nerves. <laughs> Every time he opens his mouth, it's only to spout gibberish. That's Shakespeare! Why is the tribunal so obsessed with this minfilia woman? She possesses some mystic power. Mm -hmm. I'll try to tumble her. I like my head where it is. Thank you very much. Breaks over. Alright. So we know she's still alive. We know that she hasn't broken. Which means we know they are not torturing her hard enough. Ha 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 ha! Oh wait, where does this go? Nope, nope, wrong place. Alright, you gotta follow the map. North through here. Almost back to Revenant's Toll. Oh my god, is that a T-Rex? <laughs> Stupid frogs. I hate it when they just yoink me, it's like, Whoa, What happened? Why? Whose footprints are these? Alright. Alright, boys. Literally, the boys. The girls are not here, just the boys. Alright, yes, they are there. They have not broken. Their torture is, the Imperial torture is ineffective, for the most part. Alright. So let's see some preparation. Makeshift communication jamming. Alright. So basically the radio, yes. So we're gonna grab some crystals. Get some readings. Get some readings around the big crystal we were running past just now. So that he can jam the Imperium. The Imperial, uh, what do you call it? Imperial communications, right. There's another sprout here. Oh my god, what the... <laughs> Some of those mounts just look so ridiculous, it's hilarious. Wait, where is it? Ah, oh, here it is. Why are you sprinkling dandelion spores all over the place? It's probably it's probably bad for people with allergies. You're gonna make them sneeze and make people think they have COVID. Oh, 
What is that? Oh my god, that mount is so cute! <laughs> what kind of mount is that? What is it called? You got a giant spriggan just carrying you around. Look at his stupid face. Yeah. Spriggan stone carrier. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh my god! It can fly, it's so cute! It looks so happy as well. Well, someone broke the bucket over here. Alright, I've tr three more, three more of these. Okay, wait, oh, nothing attacked. Huh. Preemptively kill this guy before he yoinks me. Alright. Is that an Easter egg? It reminds me of a uh, Matroika doll rather than a uh, Easter egg. Oh, the last one is upstairs. Oh shit, it hatched. There's a chocobo inside. What the hell? <laughs> Alright, gotta climb up. It's, where is it? Okay, it's up here, this way. Up, up, up. Okay, oh, there it is. Alright, is something gonna attack me? Nope, no attacks. Okay. Hup. Let me go back to base. Ah! This other person got yoinked as Oh, it's a bit. Can you change your pose while riding this bit? It'd be kind of funny if you can change like your sleeping positions on your on your bed mount. Oh, you can't? That's so lame. That's tragic. What a waste of opportunity. Alright, I got your reading seat. Alright. Do I have a belt upgrade? Yes, it's a belt upgrade. Yeah. Alright, what is next? Glamunt. Alright, the plan is to enter... Okay, we gotta act the part. So, we must lie in wait and observe the enemy. Okay. Where do we have to do that? Where is it? Oh wow, it's all the way at Kestrum Sentry. Okay. Oh, you're a witch now. Castrum Sentry, almost there. We can have another. There's a fate along the way. Seven minutes. Nah, let's not do that. Let's just go straight with the MSQ. Up. 
Just run past whatever I can. Okay, I may not be able to run past this. Can I? Maybe I can. Stealth. Stealth. Chocobo stealth. Yeah! Choco stealth. What was that? Oh my god, <laughs> that tank fires? These guys are tougher than they used to be. Ah, you shot me with the tank! Alright. Stealth. Stealth. I wish I had a bandana for this. Salute. Salute. You must double your efforts. Yes, yeah, a very Star Wars line. Yep, learning how to salute the Imperium way. You know what? I can just teleport back. I'm just lazy to write. The ultimate stealth teleportation. There we go. It's much faster anyway, it's just 70 gil. Yeah. Yes, we learned the Imperial Salute. I have learned the emote Imperial Salute. Okay. Alright, so now we're going to have to steal someone's uniform. Alright. Time to head back exactly where we came from and kill a bunch of Imperials and steal their uniforms. My Chocobo is still trying to learn how to fly. This snowman mount looks so ridiculous. <laughs> it looks so stupid. Hop, hop, hop. Alright.
one more. Do we have? Do I have all of it? Yes, I. I think I have all of it. All right, can teleport back. Malak. This person's name, Sak Malak, sounds like some kind of um profanity. Alright, so we're gonna repair the uniform. Gonna repair your uniform. House of Splendors, alright. Alright, bruh. Yes. Okay, helmet is back in the ship. So you're gonna fix the helmet and the uniform. Alright. So you're just waiting for him to fix the uniform. Send suck my luck, my regards. <laughs> I can't get over some of the names. What a dose! Oh, isn't it a yokai watch thing? It looks like a yoke it's a yokai watch collab thing, is it? Wow. So many collaborations with FF. Alright, the uniforms and the helmet are repaired. Foreigners, in fact, form part a greater part of Guardian's invasion force. When the Empire subjugates new territories, it assimilates people into the of the land into its armed forces. Conscripted forces are sent to subjugate faraway land. In this way, Galamal leaps rebellion in the bud and expands its territory in one fell stroke. Yeah, that makes sense. Alright, so we're gonna steal a suit of mech attack armor now. Deploys a reaper for most of its patrols. The patrols are irregular, random routes of random deployment. Alright, so we have lured them from their walls. So, Alright. Do I have to wear the Imperial uniform? Well, if it doesn't tell me not to, I will not do it.
Let me guess, yoink. Damn it. Damn it! Alright. So we're gonna meet the Imperial Patrol right over here. There they are. Oh. Okay, thanks. Alright. Damn it. Imperial salute. So they think I'm a covert operative. Unfortunately for them, I'm a double Asian. Ha ha ha! Return to the scene. Keep an eye on the insurgents. If anything goes wrong, use smoke signals. Okay. You have a sardine? Almost there. Almost there. Alright. Oh, I have to... I have to put the bait up there. Okay. Going around. Going around. Going up. Alright. Using the Imperial smoke signal. Oh, I, I think I have to drop party. Wait, give it a sec. Do I have, have I added you as friend already? Yes, I have. Alright. You had to drop party for this. Wait, I can't leave party? Disband. Alright. I can't disband. What? What? Oh, there we go. Okay. Alright, gonna steal an Imperial Walker. Oh, Sid, you here to join me? Cool. Makes sense, we need an engineer around. Send in the Reaper. Die, die, die. <laughs> Alright. Get wrecked, Imperial scum. Oh, wow, it, it's machine guns. Oh, what the hell? Oh, that is chaotic as heck. We're left with this guy. Oh, they called for reinforcements.
Alright, we almost got it. And it's down. Awesome. Well, we could have just killed the pilot instead of punching the entire thing, but, you know, I do what works. Yes, you're absolutely right. Sid is already... No, look, look. Sid has been way more useful than Alpha Nord the entire way, but everyone is more useful than Thancred. Thancred is useless. You know, at least Alpha Nord, like, states the obvious. I don't know what Thancred does. Thancred has done absolutely nothing of value. I hate Thancred. Ooh. The speedball special. If Thangrid's your boy, you didn't raise him right. <laughs> Alright, um, heading back to base. Eventually, we'll see when it happens. We will see when it happens. As of now, I blame Tancred for the entire attack on um, the entire attack on the Waking Sands, for the simple reason that I believe he might, he probably is like head of security, and security sucks. Structurally sound, but her servo chasm is faulty. All right, so they repair it. Cool. One problem. Server mechanism was faulty, okay. We ascertain that the Magitech core which drives is worn beyond use. Alright, so the Magitech core of the of the walker is damaged. Okay. So what's the solution? A Mehmet Heart. Green sen grant sentience to an automaton. That's, that's how you start Skynet. That's how you, that's how Terminator happens. This does not look like a good idea. The Goldsmith's Guild. Okay. Alright, I have to go to the Goldsmith's Guild. So I'm teleporting to Uda. See you again soon, Ash. Good to have you on stream. 43 blood. Peace for time. What is this? There's a bunch of blue quests that popped up. I didn't notice them before. The inhabitants of Tanalan long suffered the hostilities of the Amaja. The lizard man has been quiet for a time. Okay. Kid resurgence of kidnapping. Oh, okay. I'll do that when it's convenient. Time to head to the Goldsmith skill. Do 
Goldsmith. There it is. Ah, I can pick up the next monk quest. What is what what skill do I unlock next? Four point fury. Alright, that sounds that sounds important. Okay. Oh, this guy re realized that the monk was playing him. Monk bro lied, and he figured it out. Well, you don't want to put Monk Bro's name under your study. Go ahead, but you know I helped. I did what you would. I did. I did as I was told. Hey man, don't diss the chi and chakra. It works. I've been using it to beat people up. In our talks together, the simpleton monk spoke of the seventh chakra. Its awakening is the highest achievement of monkhood. The flow of it was the flow of ether within the two of you that betrayed your falsehood. The whispering of your chakra, as monk would rush to call it. These etheric whispers prove most intriguing. Huh. If one were to visit a battlefield with a certain ethereal wave, it would resonate with one's own aether. Alright. It sends reason for any ethereal wave. There may be a location that will resonate with it. So there must be an ultimate battleground to bond to unlock the seventh chakra. Alright, this guy is really... This guy knows his monk lore. What the hell? Like, he's been talking shit about the monks, but he really knows the monk lore. Last scale in the East Shroud. Alright. Slaying beasts there would release the aether of the land they're steeped in. Well, basically, that's just training then. Actually, so I'm actually curious. What happened to Lake Laskal? Laskal. La oh, he ain't gonna tell me? Huh. Okay. Alright, Serendipity. Wait, why am I the manservant? What the fuck? I'm not a manservant. God damn it, Alpha No! I'm gonna beat that little shit. Alright, you know what? I'm just gonna teleport up and down. Turn in these quests.
Uh, I'll do this next time. up here. Okay. So, oh, through here. Up here. Can go through here. I can't, can't. What? I have to go. I have, I have to go the big round. Oh. Okay. Make the big round all the way around. Ah, back in little solace. Lock skull. Okay. Through here. Oh, oh, aggro, aggro. Should be fine as long as you just run. Set the arrow meter here. No. Nope. Oh, there it is. If a bound cone. Oh shit, there are more. Alright, that was close. I got it. Get the aerometer readings. Okay, good. So, return to the Goldsmith Guild. Ok, 
Okay. Oh no, wrong. Goldsmith skill. The goldsmith skill. All right. Turn it in. I'll get my next skill. Yep. Here's your raw metal. Four point three. Oh, all right. I've opened another chakra. Awesome. Oh, wow. Immediately start another quest. Okay, give me a second. So, change to wrap the form. Four point three can only be done in wrap the form. Extends twin snakes duration by 10 seconds. All right, so there we go. Hmm, what is? All right, so he's waiting for me in Little Alamigo. Yes, he is blinded by revolution and revenge. Justice, not vengeance. I mean, it's kind of obvious, is it not? Oh, he is Alamigan as well. Huh. Hey monk bro, what's up? No, he already knew. I did not need to tell him. He already knew. Alam Eagle tried to protect them. They were the shoe of the realm. They bled to fend off Garlemald. None know their suffering, none can imagine it. Oh man, this guy is a bit... This guy is tortured. He's a tortured soul. The war gulp of the monkhood. Cloth is imbued with the power of Rao. Only monks of his fist may don it. Okay. What if I say no? So I can only say yes. <laughs> Set of a war guard was stolen, the fist has tracked the bandits. We know where the relics are. Southern Tanalan, Sepulchre, and the Circle of the Temple. In Northern Tanalan, they abandoned a major um, a Magina Mifil mine. Alright. Okay, so I'm now retrieving monk relics. Huh. But where? So 
one is up here. Okay. I see it. I'll do this quest much a little later. No reason for me to do it now. Let me just do my monk quest first. It will probably help me in my uh, main story quest. Notice the mobs are getting a little bit tougher. Temple Garb. So now I need to head down to this point here. This is called Circle of the Temple. Okay. How do I get out? Wait, how do I get out? Oh, there it is. Okay, I'll hit south. This carefree merchant ain't so carefree anymore, eh? Oh, it's in my armory chest. It's, up, it's an upgrade. Oh, it's a significant upgrade. Huh. Probably can't sneak through that, so I have to fight.
Alright, awesome. We all did. Okay. Temple. Temple relic. Okay, I got another relic now. What is it? It's gloves! Alright. So another another decent upgrade. Very nice. And the last one is in Northern Tanalan. Okay, do I have anything in Southern Tanalan? I don't I I believe I've gotten them all. Yep, I've gotten them all. Oh, I've not been there. Black brush station. Alright, time to head north. What is this? Marvelously mutable materia? Huh. Yes, Koko Samu. Transmutation. So what is this? I have no idea what this means. I have no idea what he just said. It will perform material transmutation for you free of charge. Bring five, bring bring five one unwanted, unwanted material. You transmute them to a single new piece. Oh, it's a it's a upgrade. It's an upgrading service. Cool. All right. Time to hit north. Through the Nanawan mines into northern Tanalan. Camp Blue Frog. Okay. Touching crystal. Oh, this map has two crystals. Alright, got you, Choco Keep, gotcha. Alright. Oh, and more donors here. Huh. I see. Wow, this place is pretty messed up. Oh boy. Oh, I'm in trouble. Gotta run, gotta run. Alright, I'm safe. Alright, gotta take things a little slow around here. Gotta 
take things one at a time. Alright, gotta kill this one first. down I'm dead. Shit. Alright. Let's give that another shot. Teleport to North Thalan. Camp Blue Frog. merchant around here and you may want to repair some gear. Nope. Ah there we go. Merchant and trader. Nope. The mender, yeah. Repair. Try that again. Camp Blue Frog. Maybe I'll touch this crystal first, so if I die again, I can just come back up from here. Choco keep, Choco keep, Choco keep. Okay, let's go and try to get that last piece of monk armor. Basilis here, let's try to avoid those. Alright. There's a grenade there. Let's kill this grenade first.
is that Wait for full health. Wait for full health. Alright. Sneak in this way. Where is the monk item? Is it here? I don't see it. Is it inside? Okay. Let's draw this guy back a little bit first. Dead. Oh, there's a lunatic follower here, okay. Alright. Awesome. Now to get this box. All right, temple garb. The temple boots. All right. You know, if only the monk's color is not yellow. Oh, if you need to go to sleep, go ahead and sleep. It's all right. Alright, speak with Brigadan. Where is it's in Little Alamigo? Okay. There we go, Little Alamigo. Monk bro, where you at? You make sure your hair is dry before you sleep. Alright. Three relics are mine. The fist has located the fourth. A Chirin merchant in Lower Nanosia. Alright. At God's Grip. Where is this place? At the Morabi Dry Docks. Okay. <laughs> I'm actually about to go order some McDonald's. Alright, let's see here. There we go. We're gonna we're gonna get our next monk equipment. Down here off the kitchen trailer. It's unfortunate because once I change to Samurai, I'm going to ditch all this monk armor. McNuggets? No, I was thinking, um, McLaosai. Actually, I should order, I should order my Max right now. Wait, actually, this screen would make more sense. Oh wait, gotta fight this first? Oh man, I was about to order McDonald's. Come on. You're keeping me away from ordering food. You must die. Yeah, but the monk armor is specific to the monk class. Ooh. 
Is it all? Alright. Alright, I'll take it back. Temple Garb. Alright, what's what's this? The circlet. Alright. I got a feather sticking out of my face. Alright, let me guess. He's back in Little Alamigo. Yep. So this is considered artifact gear. Alright. Alright. Oh, so here's the fifth piece. Oh, so he's giving me the fifth piece. Is he giving me a fifth piece? Did he give me a fifth piece? Oh, not yet. Oh well. Yeah, well, oh my god, do you see that last fellow's name? Le Mao Zedong. That is fucking hilarious. <laughs> okay. Turning in the quest. He's penning his thesis on the ethereal data we collected. Okay. Awesome. Now we can teleport back to Mordona. To Revenant's Toll. And I can order my McDonald's. Oh man, it's so strange to see, like, this mismatching colors. No, no, I, I need to dye. I need to dye the... Can I dye the shirt? Yes, I can dye the shirt. Okay. So, uh, what can I dye it to? General. There we go. Woolen Tulik. Sunset orange, bone white. Oh man. This is a different color, but... Alright, let's just go with sunset orange, I guess. Uh, wait. No, it doesn't look nice. Uh, I have a feeling none, nothing I have matches. So you, maybe dying is not a good idea. Maybe glamouring is the right answer. Alright, let's glamour this and see what we have. Let's try on. Oh my god, I look like a clown. Okay. No. Cotton shit. No, 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 no. Uh... No. No. Uh, uh, none of what I have looks good. Uh, uh, man. Man, this is tough. 
This is tough. Alright, I'll try this. Okay, let's see. Can I die this? This is tough. Huh. You know what? I think I will have to deal with looking like this for now. Hmm. Uh, no, I'm going to diet. I don't care. <laughs> <laughs> Order McDonald's. Ah, look at the tiger kitty, so cute. So cute. Oh man. Looking like a clown. This is why I shouldn't have chosen the monk. The monk's... The monk's set armor looks so weird. Oh, kind of free camera doesn't don't show us like a chocobo's backside. Having the feathers in our face. Chicken McCrispy. Hmm. All right, yeah. Chicken McCrispy meal plus a McSpicy burger a la carte. Yes, 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 that's the plan. A few more levels drag- Oh, I, I wasn't looking at the dragon, I was- Why does it show us a floorboard? Man, this camera needs to work. It, it needs to work on a free camera. <laughs> Alright. There we go, the McSpicy. Oh, should I get a double McSpicy instead? A single McSpicy or double McSpicy? How hungry am I right now? Hmm. Hmm. I'm gonna roll. I'm gonna roll. Single? Okay, fine. I'll go for a single then. Oh, the delivery charge is not that bad. Awesome. It arrives oh, pretty fast in about 15 to 20 minutes. You know what that means? That means I should put on some pants.
Let's continue and let's continue until McDonald's arrives. Alright, Slav one. Alright, witch, what's up? Do I have a memo heart? Yes, I got it. Must have cost the Empress ransom. No, I should give it to us for free. Courtesy of Alphanol. Ah, influential family. Knew he was a rich kid. Stupid rich kid. Alright. Magitek armor engaged. She just needs a loving tap. You just gonna bang it? Ouch. Yeah, if it doesn't work, just hit it a few times. She's alive! She's alive! Oh, do I get to play with it? Alright, let's go for our test run. Okay. Am I supposed to head up there? Okay. Jump back down and sprint north. Okay. Ah! Stupid frogs. Alright, making our way back. Hup. 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 Alright. Torso remains stable, alright. Good job, you fixed it good. Good job, boys. It's not as responsive as it should be, and he doesn't know why. The heart is in pristine condition. The inner workings are different, maybe. Whereas a Magitech core only serves to conduct impulses, Mammoth's heart enable automata. So it's alive, it feels. Okay. Make her feel welcome. Everything she does is magic tech. Okay. So there is a consciousness in our magic tech because of the mammoth's heart. Pilot would be required to control every movement manually. So using a mammoth's heart is not compatible with Galleon technology. Huh.
<laughs> a little dance. But the Imperials are coming. Oh, they have a guy in full armor. Oh, oh. Oh, now they call me the Icon Slayer. All right. Calling for reinforcements. Signal jam. Oh, so they're gonna try to destroy it. Yeah, that makes sense. Destroy enemy technology, don't allow them to get anything. Oh, time to protect our... Protect our walker. Alright, let's see. Kill the Lancer first. Take their attention off. Oh shit. They keep running past me, god damn it. Alright, we are left with the big one. Magitech Vanguard, okay. We got it. And it's down. We got it. Everyone alright? Everyone safe. Yay! Oh, there's some Terminator shit right here. Skynet's activated. So it's active now. So we can use her. Use her to infiltrate the castrum so we can save Minfilia and, and gang. Bring, bring. All right. Servo mechanisms functional. <laughs> Not to install a mammoth's heart on the enterprise. All right. Dun 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 dun. dun, dun. All right, are we are 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 are, are we ready? Oh, what's going on? All right, he's here to show his respects to the people who are going to take the empire down. All right. 
Now what did the Empire do to this guy to make him pissed off? He wasn't the first? Okay. Oh, did they kill his mom? They killed... and his sister. Oh, he's from Alamigo. They put the family in the camp. As a boy, he was forced to do hard labor. Mother and sisters were forced to do far worse. I guess we know what, what happened to them. They hid their suffering as best they could. But they but he knew. Alright. There's a lot of rape that goes on. They were picking their way around the gorge not far from the walls when they caught them. Rather than allow themselves to be taken again, they leapt over the edge before his very eyes. Ooh. This is supposed to be a video game. Ah, oh, this is a good game. Tackling serious themes of war, suffering. He swore his revenge on the Empire. He became an adventurer to hone his skills. But with two decades gone on, he has achieved nothing. War. <laughs> war. War never changes. But then Solid Snake will come in and war. War has changed. You ain't been here 10 minutes and you've already done more than a bloody did in 10 years. Alright. Once you got your plan back, uh, once you get your friends back, you're planning to go after the Empire, don't pretend you ain't. Yep. First we say that I would like the Game of Thrones politicking in Heaven's Sword. Then you say I would like the politicking in Stormblood. There seems to be a lot of politicking going on in the next expansions. You should strike back at the Empire with your own hands, say the word. We're glad to have you with us. Uh, he will decline. Uh, he knows he's not a fighter. Okay. He knows where his strength is. This guy is the information and planning guy. Yeah. His, his talents lie in scheme and not in sword, sword, uh, sword play. No, play to your strengths. Play to your strengths. Hmm. Wherever the Empire goes... Misery inevitably follows. Alright. Do we kill God in Final Fantasy? Yeah, I mean, we've already been killing gods. So, like... To be expected. Alright, it's time to rescue our friends. Speak to Sid while disguised as an Imperial soldier. Okay. Wait, wrong. Here we go. Equip. And the helmet. Is this alright? <laughs> Wouldn't they recognize my pants? <laughs> okay, I guess this works. It would recognize my pants, I'm wearing like Alamegan pants. I'm pretty sure the Empire recognized those pants, come on. Yeah, that's it. So this is my disguise.
cut the dashing figure in Imperial Black and Crimson. But now is not the time for Jess. <laughs> Look at my pants! Look at my pants! Oh man, that's such a mismatch of colors. Alright. No man. No, look. Look, th that's awful. Look at- That's awful. That's an awful disguise. Alright, so Sid will have the Enterprise as our escape route. Spitball special. Huh. They must have rehearsed that so many times. Wedge will lead the way, stay close to him, and don't do anything suspicious, of course, other than wear yellow pants. So what have the girls been doing? They left shortly before we arrived. We planned that they should linger in the vicinity, cover our retreat. But the approach of an Imperial visitor... Okay, so they were, they are causing distractions outside. Alright. It's like, I'm the one guy who didn't change my pajama pants. Ugh. Oh, the slap up. Ooh. You have spirit. That I will allow. Yet you struggle to the benefit of none, least of all. Yourself. Cat fight. This echo of yours intrigues us. We desire only to understand it. And for that, we need your help. You wish to be rid of the icons, do you not? You would have saved yourself a great deal of torment had you accepted our aid from the beginning. Mm -hmm. Tell me everything, and I shall end it quickly. Refuse, and though you beg for death, you shall not have it. Which will it be? That's some pretty basic wish, torture. My dear Minfilia. Unpleasant though it will be for all concerned, you leave us no choice but to employ more rigorous methods of study. Uh-huh. Be so kind as to deliver the prisoners to Castrum Meridianum. Meridianum. Yes, my lady. Yes, He's so enthusiastic. Let's deliver the prisoner for more torture. All right. So she only whimpers after after Livia leaves. Okay. <laughs> Alright. Take pay no pay, pay no attention to my pants. Yep. Supplies aren't gonna move themselves, neither are the prisoners. Imperial salute. Salute! The tribunals commanded me to arrange for the prisoners to be moved. Okay. The Scions of the Seven Dawn, captured by the tribunals herself. If you don't believe, have a look in the storage tower. Oh, they are, they're kept in the storage tower. Okay. Uh, the place is kept under high alert. Oh, Wedge is over here. Hey, Wedge. Cut an imposing figure. Not really. The shirt barely fits. Pop 
part of the maintenance wait part of the maintenance crew are from the Occidents. Being an engineer does not exempt oh sorry not happy that I didn't salute you. Imperial salute. There we go. Salute. Pay the pay the prisoners no mind. Okay. Someone here to work, not gulp at Eosia's defeated heroes. Alright, alright. Hey Bakes. We need a special key to get past this bulkhead. Okay. Ah. Chao King. Shouldn't I be with my post? I suppose so. She has fallen for one of the prisoners. She's all she can think of. He's a deviant for wanting her to salute him. Which one? Which one? Imperial salute. Greetings, comrade. Forgive for asking. Have not visit the storage towers? He dropped something in there. Oh, I dare say you know the one I mean, the Savet Blonde? Goodness, no. It's a Lalafalian less. Oh, he fell in love with Tataru. Aww. Bruh, aren't you a little big and tall for her? She's so adorable it hurts. I want to sweep her up in my arms and squeeze her till my arm aches. Aww. Okay, poor guy. A low centurion. Why am I not at the post? Or oh, yeah, all right. Imperial salute. Salute. Why do I need to access the storage tower? Ah, uh, maintenance, maintenance. Yes, yes. The tribunus behest. Take my ID key and see its return when my errand is concluded. All right. Sub bigs. Yep, I got the key. Alright, work your engineer magic. There's a very enthusiastic team right here. Everyone's waving, filling their arms around, big thumbs up. Alright, examine the steel door. Affable Imperial. Okay. Interacting with the door. Oh! Okay, fighting time. But... My McDonald's is almost here, so we have to take a short break. I guess you'll be just going to sleep right now. But if you're still around... Well, if you're still around, you're still around then. <laughs> Alright, I'll be right back.
All right, I'm back. So let's hit back. All right. I'm gonna reduce, uh, okay. 
Step 1 to Midnight McDonald's, go for the fries. Because if you don't go for the fries in time, they become soggy and then you don't want to eat them anymore. Think about McDonald's fries. They don't have the perfect balance of saltiness. The salt to potato ratio is generally not bad. But the thing is, I do have a preference for thick, fluffier fries. But for what it is, McDonald's fries are not bad. But only if they're hot. If they're not hot, they're not good. Whole fries are the worst. Music is way too epic for fry eating fries. Hmm. And if anyone's wondering what I got for drink, this midnight McDonald's meal, what do you get for drinks? Well, Coca Cola. Always Coca Cola. You know, at one point of time, I might have gone for iced lemon tea instead. But you know, it kind of just lacks the fizz. The fizz of Coca-Cola just feels good, man. Mm.
done with the fries. We can continue with the game. I'll get my Biden or my Mac Spicy once I'm done with this mission. Mm. Got my Coca, my Coca Cola with me. All right. Let's begin. Time to rescue Minfilia, Tataru, Urienji, and Papalimo. Let's get our boys back. Oh, are they gonna execute the others? Oh, Tataru noticed us. Yes. It's time to go. Oh, they know we stole a Reaper. Okay. Take as many men and scout the area. We want to find that Reaper. Alright, it's time to go. Action time. Oh, Wedge got his time to shine, now that he's got a Reaper to ride on. Alright. I'll eat it. Getting out. Back in. Alright, awesome. It's all right, Tataru, my dear meerkat. No, we did not see. I did not see Thancred. He was not part of our gang. He's missing. The useless man. To linger here, use us no answer. Yeah, let's get out. Everyone out. Oh, Olivia's gonna be pissed. And what have we here? Livia versus Ishtola. Oh, 2v1, cat fight.
be chance of commotion outside the construct's walls. Alright, so they cause chaos outside, everyone left to fight. One of the most uncomfortable things she's ever stowed away in. So they got into the phantom train. So they got into the tr supply train for the Empire. You gotta be sure. Okay. Alright, face retribution. We killed our friends. Oh no, Imperial Reinforcements. Hmm, not bad either. His, Alex His Excellency is in the hangar with our guests. Okay. Okay, she's pissed. Good. Get angry. Make mistakes. Oh, Tataru, don't be scared. Oh, that was unnecessary. Stop, stop thinking with your other head and think with your head. Hold them off. You look after Tataru and Minfilia. All right. Let's go, Shions. Sion Squad, let's go. One down. Alright, gonna kill the caster. Caster down. Okay. It's invulnerable, how do we beat this? Okay, something is generating a shield. Where is it? Oh, I see it. Shield generator. generators should be down. Is it taking damage? Yes, it's taking damage. Or oh, Papalimo is tanking. Alright, good, it's taking damage. It's going down fast. We got this. Alright, good job, Sion Squad. Oh shit, there's more. There's more shields. Where is it? Okay, I see you. Alright. 
Are they both are, are they both vulnerable? No. The other one? Yeah, the other one vulnerable. Alright, this one's it. Shoots you up. Where are you? Where are you? Ah, I see you. Another one. Okay, this one's not shooted. That's right, Papa Limo. It is a colossal waste of iron. Got it. Is it? Good drops. Scion Squad. Uh oh, we're surrounded. Powerful Kung Fu. Let's go! You ditched your Magitek armor. Fool of a Lalafell! Well, excuse me. She's all yours if you think you can do any better. Oh my god, you're so British! <laughs> They're so British! Oh my god! I love it! Hear you. Okay. Two. Three. Four. 
five. Nice. I know not which is more pitiful. The charlatans who rule Eorzea. Or the masses that clamor for their implausible panaceas. Hmm. I see that which they cannot. This realm founders for want of a ruler with true power. The power to cast down icons. If you continue to deny this truth, it is the people who will suffer. Embrace reason. Who are you talking to? Are you talking to me? Oh, whoa. Whoa. What in the seven hells? Nice evasive maneuver, Sid. Oh, shit. Godzilla's there. Oh, no. It's here. Twelve preserve us. They finished it. Ultima weapon. Hmm. So it has a name. It is a relic of ancient Alag, excavated from its resting place deep beneath Alamigo. The Alagans used it to crush primal and foe alike, and now the Garleans mean to do the same. Ultima weapon. Damn you, Gaius! Look! There, beside the Black Wolf! An Asian. Lahabria. An overlord, no less. His garb attests to that. Lahabrea. It could only be him. Bruh. Angry. I knew it, you. you You traitorous! He was Lahabria? Oh my god! No! No, this cannot be! We have to go now! Hang on! Tancred, I knew it! Tancred! No! Tancred, I knew I hated you! I knew. I knew it. You, you asshole. You scum. I knew. I, I knew there was a reason I didn't like you all along. All that time, the enemy was beside me, and I never even suspected. And to think well, I did. It was I who suggested that Thancred investigate the Asians. <sighs> Could I have been so blind? Because you're a kid, kid. Small wonder the enemy knew our every move and where to find us. Ugh. Confound it all. I knew it. I knew it all along. I called it. No. No, this is not the time for self-doubt. The Alliance leaders stake their hopes on the Scions, but now they believe us all dead or missing. When they learn of the Empire's new weapon... We cannot be certain what they will do. We must go and offer them what assurances we can that defeat is not inevitable. Cryo, this is Minfilia. The situation I may have taken an ill turn. So forgive me if I seem brusque. The item I requested... But the battle is far from over. And so long as Wonderful. we stand together, there shall ever be hope of victory. Urgently. How soon can it be delivered? I am in your debt, my friend. Who are you on the phone with, Minfilia? The people of Eorzea falter for want of such hope. Let us provide it. Let us bear to them the tidings that the Scions of the Seventh Dawn are returned. Matters are coming to a head. I hope we can count on you. My regards to Grandfather. I am 
am ready. Let us pay a visit to the Council of the Alliance leadership. I gotta give Alpha Not some credit. He's pretty good at epic speeches. They're already ready, huh? And all three are already united. All gathered in Uda. Yeah, Ishgard ain't gonna help, man. Ah, Xiao Long Bao. Nanamo looks like she always looks like a little dumpling and she's so adorable. Then Belsa claims to wield the power to smite the primals. Well, his weapons did one shot, like almost all of them. Or sur surrender or resistance, you must answer as one. If only all alliances act this way. Ah! Was she impressed? Oh, you idiot. You sacrificed your, your Reaper, your Reaper Mac, just to impress a girl? That was bad tactical decision making. Wedge, you dumb shit. Yeah, that's right. At least we escaped. Oh no, man, Sid. I love dramatic methods. It's climatic as heck. Let's do it more often. Alright, off and all. Always having a plan of action. I appreciate it. Oh, I thought we were singing. Oh, it's all right. We love you. All right, Dankrit's plight. Yeah, yeah. Fuck that guy. They are gathered in a fragrant chamber. Alright. We gotta make sure they don't surrender. Okay, how do we get out of here?
No, I shouldn't be dressed. I shouldn't be dressed in freaking... Yeah, there we go. Walking around in enemy uniform does not seem like a good idea. Hey, Momodi. Chamber of Rule. Alright. And there it is, yeah, frequent chambers. Hello, Bartolomeo, it's been a while. I bring tidings of death and ruin. Uh, we keep treading the same ground. Van Belsar's demands are clear. Alas, our minds are not. I've never been one to shy from a fight, but if this weapon of theirs can do all they claim. It has been five years since the Calamity, and our people have scarce begun to rebuild their lives. Can we now, in good conscience, call upon them to risk what little they have left? I would spare them the pain of further conflict. Conflict. The Empire brings it, whether you wish it or not. Conflict, I say, though that would imply forces set in opposition. If the combined might of three primals could not stay Garlemald's new terror, what meaningful resistance can we offer? We who struggle to quell the foes who rise up within our own borders. Long have we fought the primals, but to what end? We strike them down at no small cost. Only for them to rise again and again. Are we to play this profitless game for the rest of days? I, for one, grow tired of it. Mistake me not. I do not propose to trade one tyranny for another. I love liberty. But conciliation need not mean oppression. By the twelve. Though neither of you cried surrender, your every word betokened it. <sighs> Not that I deny there is truth in what you say, nor can I rightly claim that Urda is ready to fight. Refugees flood our gates, and beastmen swarm our land, while the great and the good do nothing. My flames struggle to bear the burden. I put on a grand show at the Remembrance Service, made all manner of lofty promises. I've made good on not a bloody one. Do not blame yourself, Raban. You said only that which the people needed to hear. All present have done the same. Our citizens had become lost to hope. If our words served to kindle it in them anew, Better we speak than remain silent. 
Our enemy condemns us for failing our people. Yet what does he care for their well-being? While we labored to rebuild their lives, the Black Wolf built instruments of murder with which to end them. Oh, little Xiao Long Bao has the most conviction of the three, of the four of them. Her Majesty speaks true. <coughs> For all our failures, the people's well-being has ever been our foremost priority. While none among us ever doubted that the Empire would one day resume its war, we scarcely had means enough to solve the problems of the present. Aye, which is why we look to others to safeguard our future. The Scions of the Seventh Dawn. Alas, they are gone. And the Black Wolf is at our door. This is why you need to send agents to reinforce the Scions instead of asking them to do all the work for you. Admiral! I fear you are mistaken! Okay. Alphinord? Minfilia? And seven hells, Master Garland. And you, dear friend. We're all here together again. By Ralga, you're alive, all of you. Mm -hmm. As we approached, I would swear I heard talk of surrender, but I know that cannot be. It is not the Eorzean way. Hear me, my friends. Accepting the Garlean's offer to vanquish the Primals would be folly. Folly, I say. For might is not the answer to the Primal threat. Indeed, the more the Empire exerts its strength, the worse matters will become. Primals enter this world when mortals call upon them, and mortals are wont to appeal to a higher power when they are desperate. Nothing is more certain to breed desperation in the beast tribes than the Garlean's proposed solution. The true answer lies in a lasting peace. But the Garlean's only know war and conquest. Should Eorzea fall into their hands, there will be such suffering as none can imagine. We are not blind to the many challenges that each of your nations face. Yet you must not give in. I. Remember five years ago when you wagered all for the sake of the realm? Remember what you fought for. Let the memories rekindle the fire in your heart. For Eorzea has need of it again. Come what may, we Scions will never give up the fight. And so I bid you stand with us. And together we shall safeguard the future of the realm. A great man once said that a shrewd merchant grasps not for the quick profit, but invests in the future. Wise words, eh, Raban? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I calling him out directly. Your words stir and shame me in equal measure. How could I contemplate surrender? I know full well that all we have we owe to the sacrifices of those who went before us. Yet the seeming hopelessness of our plight robbed me of my insight. We Gridanians have no love for war, yet we have still less for those who would threaten our homeland. Ever have we fought to protect those things we hold dear. And this shall never change. She repeat herself from her speech. From her speech during the remembrance ceremony. Gridania will go to war. We will fight the Empire. For the sake of the realm and all who abide here. <laughs> and I'm more surprised. <laughs> oh dear. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> At long last, I hear words worthy of a founder of the Alliance. Ralbon. 
on. Are we to be all done? Uh, calling him out. I lost one homeland. The thought of losing another had blunted my resolve. But no man knows better than I that if you want aught, you'd best be ready to die for it. With great danger comes the chance for great glory and great profit. We old dons who have turned sand into gold know this well. How many times have we fallen into the pit of despair, only to have you pluck us out? I fair lost count. Reckless, the lot of you, like bloody pirates. Well, I won't waste my breath trying to talk you round, on account of being a pirate myself. And the pirate who shrinks from a challenge is no pirate. All right. Those who would pick a quarrel with us must choose. Back down or go down with all hands. Let the Garleans come. The united strength of Limsa Lominsa will be waiting for them. If our realm is to be free of this pall of darkness, let it be by our own hands. For Aeolia! We must needs consider how the weapon may be brought to bear against us. The Maelstrom will secure strategic points along the coastline. In the meantime, the flames will deploy at... Be at ease, my friends. You have banished our doubts. Pray leave the military matters to us. And retire... Pray to return to the waking sands. We will send word anon. So are we going to have, um, oh, so we're really going to return to the Waking Sands. Okay. Are we going to have, um, actual security at the Waking Sands this time? Ah, look at that. He has the full set. Oh, I have not opened my weapon chest. Ah, much better. I don't like those giant claws. The giant claws look awful. Alright. Yeah, we still do not have security. Holy shit. Yeah, I'm in failure. We're gonna need, we're gonna need more security. We don't want a repeat of what happened. Oh. Oh, we do have security. Okay, so this guy is from the Maelstrom. This is a uh, immortal flame. So her sister was part of the original. Hey there. So we have new scions. You're alive! Oh man. I'm, I'm, I'm glad to see you alive. Alright, who are you? Wixton. Okay, there's a new guy. I don't remember him. Orienje, how are you doing, man? How fast the realm? I have no idea what you just said. But, 
yep, carry on, carry on. Ah, everyone's assembled here. Which is stupid fool. Yep. Ah, oh, really to get to work. So these two are thinking about work, and she, he, this guy is thinking about my dear little meerkat. Huh. Uh, off and all. Alright, stay the New York first. Papa Limo, how have you been? How have you been? Ah, uh, everyone knows you got her covered. Alright, Ida. Yep, yep, that's a good idea. Ungrateful little guy. Isola, how are you doing? Oh, he and I have much to discuss as well. Uh, little meerkat, how you doing? Yes, yes, how considerate. Minfilia, what do you have planned? I cannot well express my relief to think that the Alliance came so close to surrender. But the fire in their hearts has been rekindled, and they will fight to the last. This warmth inside. Did you feel it too, Grandfather? I would know something. Was that your power at work earlier? Nothing of the sort. The leaders of Eorzea had lost their way. I merely helped them to find it again. Oh, hello. Yes, our party returned just a moment ago. How close are you? Who's there on the phone? It's all right, Sid. We must needs plan our next move. Pray continue liaising with your respective nations. Sid, would you be our man in Ulda? I'll be whatever and wherever you need me to be. Oh, reliable. All right. Yeah, take over the job from Bushido Tancred. We haven't a moment to waste. All right, let's do this. Tancred's fate weighs heavy on my mind. I cannot bear to think of him enthralled to an Asian. Are you sure he's enthralled, or is it just him? Mayhap you know this already, but the Asians are immortal beings without physical form. Since time immemorial, they have fanned the flames of chaos from the shadows. That they might work unseen, the Asians entrap and possess mortal men by means of malign artifacts known as Crystals of Darkness. Oh. So he's possessed. One such crystal may yet be the key to saving Thancred. This is a crystal of darkness. A mere replica, created using data obtained from anomalous crystals found across Eorzea. It comes to us courtesy of the students of Baldessian, our distant allies. Even for an Archon, Thancred's talents are exceptional. We all had complete confidence in him. It was for this reason that none among us foresaw the danger in sending him to investigate the Asians alone. 
Tancred had been striving to fill the void left by Louis Soir. Yet, it was plain that he was overtaxing himself. He was overtaxing himself? No, no. He was flirting with city towns, like, towns ladies. Sleeping with their wives, uh, sleeping with, um, sleeping with the wives uh, behind the husband's back. He was womanizing all the way, man. Yeah. He would volunteer for everything and work till he was dizzy. What? I don't see all that. And the toll taken by his exertions made him vulnerable to Asian influence. The crystal that binds Thancred must be somewhere on his person. If we could but destroy it, his Asian possessor would be compelled to relinquish control over him. You have proven the stoutest of allies, standing with us through thick and thin. Yet the most perilous struggle is still to come. For the sake of the realm and Thancred, I ask that you lend us your strength once more. Alright, I'm doing this for you and the realm. I'm not doing this for Thancred. I'm not doing this for Tancred. It's for you Thank and the realm, alright? From the bottom of my heart. You're welcome. As I am sure you are aware, the realm was saved from certain doom five years ago by heroes known as the Warriors of Light. What you may not be aware of is that your many feats in service to the Scions have prompted folk to make certain... comparisons. Mm-hmm. I must confess, you do remind me of them. Yet remember this, however glorious the past, it is the heroes locked to be judged on the deeds of the present. A new darkness threatens the realm, and the people cry out for a savior. I believe that you are he, a warrior of light, here in the present, guided by the crystal's will. Come, my friends, let us fight to safeguard the future of our beloved Eorzea. Operation Archon Level Forty Nine. So I need two more levels. Oh wow, this is the first time I'm actually level block level block. Well shit. So I guess what I have to do is um duty roulette. Is it? Is this it? Yeah, duty roulette. Bronze Lake. Go down to the docks west of Bronze Lake. So that is where the dungeon she was that she almost died at. Okay. <clears throat> this place right next to Kemp's bronze lake okay let's head over there all right and I have not explored outer Lenos here huh I think I'll make it a point to drop by there 
first things first. So the Wandering Palace is over here. Let's unlock it. Wait, what? Oh, there he is. Oh, she lost someone in there. Alright. Oh, they got attacked by a Thornberry. Oh, the Thornberry killed him. Oh, shit. Only Aline and this guy made it out. There's no treasure in there, only death. Oh, poor girl, she thinks that we can save her friend. Tenacity is a tank stat, yeah. Skill speed. Alright, this one. It's a level 49 gear, so can't put it on yet. Alright, let's hit up and explore. It's then off Apollon was here. Okay, Apollon was here. I have some stuff to kill for the hunting log up there. Apollon was here. Two in Apollon was here. And the rest in the South Shroud. Alright. Alright, yeah, I remember. This is where. Where are you? Went in the kill Titan. Alright, found this new location. Let's just run past these cobolds. Run past these cobolds and go straight to Camp Overlook. Uh, Camp Overlook is right over there. Right, I found it. Attuned. Is there a Choco Keep here? There is no Choco Keep here? Huh. For real. Alright. Upper Lanosius Oakwood. Where is it? Oh, Upper Lanosia is down there. This is Outer Lanosia. So I need to head south to Upper Lanosia. Alright, I see it. Alright. Leveling roulette, let's go.
Ouch! Alright, let's join another leveling roulette. And it gets easier once you figure out how it works. I just need to get um get more optimized to with my rotation. So I am an Oakwood, all right. So let's see. There we go. That's the self. Level sync this. Oh man, a lot of my skills are not available, I just realized that explains it. I totally forgot. Level sync also removes my skills. Leveling roulette, okay. Oh well. Oh wow, it's another Garuda. Lots of people are. Lots of people are stuck at Garuda right now. Huh?
Alright. Let's do that again. What's this? Oh, this is the front lines. Uh, let's not do this now. Alright, so where are the coral pups? There were a bunch of snow, but I guess that was only during the fate. But the fate is over. So... I suppose I will find them around. Wild wolf. Is it trying crap? Huh. So it's only when that fate is active. Ah, there we go, Forest Yargon. Three more. One more. Okay, at least this guy is not aggressive. Alright. Coral pups. Ah, uh, there it is. All the way top in this little corner. Last one. Alright. So rest in South Shroud, South Shroud, South Shroud, South Shroud. They're all in the South Shroud. So let's go there. The Black Shroud. South Shroud. Alright, the upper... Okay, there we go. Let me guess. Garuda again. Oh, it's not Garuda this time. It's Ifrit.
right. Well, that's fast. What's next? Let's see, let's see, it's a dungeon or a boss? A dungeon! Hawkmana! Alright! Let's hope the tank knows what he's doing. I think I'll stick a single target. Okay, maybe I'll not. I'll just AOE. Carpet stain. thing is where is the key hmm
leveled up.
I guess last time I asked the party if everyone here are wild refugees. So the Black Mage is a returning player. He played when Heaven Sword came out. So he just decided to came back come back recently. Wow! None of them are WoW refugees? in this room. I don't see anything. Are the yellow keys here? Wow! So none of these people are WoW refugees. It's just the media bus around the game recently just brought them in and brought them back. This is interesting. This Suyami, that's the healer, is a new player, as in she's new to MMORPGs. So right now, Final Fantasy is bringing new players back into the game. Wow.
All right. Alright, I'm level 48 now. So for my MSQ, I need... For level 49, I need one more level. So I will still need to head back into my duty queue. In while, let's search for is this a small upper paths? No, silent ball. Silent ball would be coral claw hunters. Did I run past them? These are the red belly guys. See boss or dungeon? Dungeon. Oh, it's been a while. This is Copper Bell Mine, isn't it? Yes, it's Copper Bell Mine. It's been a while since I've been here. All aboard! This run is going quite well.
This tank is low 47, is it low? Oh. This tank is level 47, but I'm sure he has a max level character somewhere. Got him. Oh shit, I grew something. Keep going, keep going. Good job, good job. I got it, I got it, let's go. Alright, I forgot. Food. Big one should be coming soon. All right, they're all dead. The 
big ones here? Nope. There we go. He's dead. You go hit tank.
This dungeon run is smooth. Smooth. Like butter. The like XP gain is really good. I like it. <laughs> so cute. Alright, level 48. Let's see here. No, let's do that again. 
Oh, the dungeon roulette kills are really fast. Thought I saw two people down there. Strange. I am not finding the people I need for my hunting logs. Maybe they are just at the other side. Hmm. Ah, there we go. Three more, I need three more. Alright, I guess just jump in and I'll finish it up once I finish this encounter. It's free again, awesome. Oh no, yes, yes, it's free. That's a dancer. Oh, this tank is doing much better than the tank we had previously. At least he, this tank is staying still and tanking it like a real tank. God, ouch. All right, got him. Pretty close to level 49. Alright, where are the hunters? The hunters are inside. Take us rot. Alright, there is a hunter in there. I need one more. I'm pretty sure I'll find this one last hunter on the way out. 
There he is. Feels kind of bad beating up just people, you know, but. Oh, if it has to be done. So, next one is in the small mouth Orobon in the upper paths. And Buck F in the upper paths as well. The big mouth would be in the lower paths. So, where is. Okay, lower paths is down there. Upper paths is up here. Alright. So. here. I assume they'll be near water. Alright. Dungeon kills are real fast. Ah, this place. Oh, so smooth. All right. Alright, simple and clean is the way that you're making me feel tonight.
And it's dead. Nice. Very nice. Infantry bandana. Nah. Makes me look like Batman. Is this a oh this is a boss as well, huh? Out of my own bubble. You can't trap me. My kung fu is too strong. Oh, someone wasted the limit break. We don't have limit break for this boss. This is not what I like to see.
All right. Last boss. The dragon. The dragon. No, this tank is a bit impatient. Uh. People are still looking at cutscenes, man. Alright, that's it. Alright. Another one. Now I'm in the upper paths. Small moth, I would expect to find them near the water. There they are. Alright, there's a bunch there. One more. There we go. Okay, what's next? Buck F. Hmm. It's in the upper path, so it's around here.
Where are the bomb Fs? Hmm. Yeah, there they are. In their own little lagoon. So, the last one is the big mouth Ouroboros in the lower lower paths. Okay, where are the big mouth Oroborn? Where are they? There they are. It's surprisingly small. One more. And I've completed my logs. Nice. Alright, let's see here. So right now I'm in the oh, I've seen I've seen I've seen quite a bunch of them. Alright, let's see here. I am in the lower paths in the South Shroud. Anything in the South Shroud? Nope. Nope. Alright, these guys are in the Central Shroud. Central Shroud and East Shroud. But I'm right next to Eastern Thunderland. Any of them for Eastern Thunderland? None. Nope. Alright. Let's hit up the central shroud. Sorrow Haven. East Shroud. Lascal. Alright. Just one more level. Just one more level. So that the next next time I come in I can accept the MSQ straight away. Alright. Boss or dungeon. Is it this? I don't think I've been here. Hmm. Palatali, this is the first time I've been here. Holy shit, okay. Didn't expect to end up in a new dungeon. Oh, and these guys are in my hunting logs for Maelstrom. Ah! Nice.
I don't have any of my AoE skills for this dungeon. Clear these guys out. Is this the first boss? Looks like it's the first boss. Ah, oh, I don't even have my YOT. Mendos coming from. Alright, we got it. Right. 
Everything is dying so fast. This is great. Doctor's crook. Red as the doctor's cock. Oh my god. these one more for this and we're gonna get um is this is a boss suppose it is treasure coffers. Right. Man, this place is large.
bring that chest. Alright, so we've mapped the whole of Halatali. Fantastic. So this is the final boss. What is this? Oh, it's a big ogre. Thanks for waiting. Okay. Lotus Ock. Yes, of course, need that. It's an Intel ring, so greed. Lotus Buckler? No, I don't need that. I'm level 49 now. Sweet. Since I'm here. Oh, true and motors is actually. Nah, I don't need to do this now. Time to get some rest. It's been a long playthrough, it's really late at night. It's time to rest. My 
Inventory is getting filled up. Oh, no. Lifts over here. Let's see. Yes. I see you have a level 18 wrist and a level 5 necklace. Oh my god. Alright. Inkeep. Let's retire to a room. Alright, before we go, let's see. Is there is there anything that actually looks good? No. Doesn't look good with the pants, the yellow pants. Nope. Huh, maybe I can disclamour this one. Nope. Nope. Nah. Nope. Nah. Nope. Nope. Oh, this is as good as this is as good as it's, uh, like, as good as it's gonna get, huh? Well, it's time to sleep. Actually, I'm gonna put. Why do I have more than one of these? Huh. I can probably sell this. I'll put this inside. Can't be died. Oh. These pens are pretty nice, though. Time to sleep. Good night, guys. It's been a good adventure so far. <laughs>